It's a minor trek to a major mission. Task Force in Dalu deploying out just up the street to South Finnegayan at the Thad site. No one knows or lives our motto, always ready, always there, more than our families do. Families, only you can master all the changes and adjustments to your lives and keep the home front. For many military families, this relocation, only seven miles away, comes as a relief compared to previous send-offs, which sometimes meant months and years apart. This time with a sense of comfort, loved ones with yellow ribbons pinned on their chest, a symbol of home front support, congratulated 85 members of this 6th THAD security group with a ceremony. For specialist James Hogan and proud father to his two kids, Emily and Michael, this is his third time deploying, a blessing he says for the relocation just another village away, where he can serve his country, island, and as a dad. To be deployed, it's a great feeling knowing that I'm doing my part so my family can sleep better at night. It feels good knowing that uh, sometimes we're able to go home, spend time with our families, but still, you know, there, there is still a mission at hand that still has to be completed. Quality time Emily and Michael are looking forward to. I feel good because I can play games with him and spend time with him. Dad's mission, however, is critical, as Guam remains a target of missile launches from areas like North Korea. The Terminal High Altitude Area Defense Battery is in place to protect Guam and the region from adversaries should they attempt a missile launch. Today, Governor Leon Guerrero speaks to the troops. Being able to know that there is that FAD defense system here and that our Guam National Guard is a key in protecting and securing it is a great, I think, uh, peace of mind uh, for me and for our people. A send-off, she says, though not very far, still comes with great respect, dignity, and recognition. Destiny Cruz, KOAM News.